star turn pickleball player Donald Young will start us. Let's play pickleball. Right out. Well, that Been was ripping twoies and forehands all day long to get here. Yeah, lefty different patterns. Uh, Fed's going to have to make the adjustment. Uh, <laughs> clearly, he can rip the ball from the back of the court, but I'm excited to see Donald Young uh, uh, zero, zero, zero. evolution into a well-rounded pickleball player. How often will he come forward and how comfortable is he up there? Point. Yeah, his athleticism is no joke. So we showed that Fed has played just under 300 matches. On, this is number 11 for Donald. Total, <laughs> not like in this tournament or something. Well, a quality dramatic <laughs> pause there, Dave. That was good stuff. <laughs> Zero one. one. I heard Donald say that's a good shot, and it certainly was. Yeah. Fed uses the front half of the court really well. Yeah, he certainly does. Is that just, he, never, he seems to never do too much. Yeah, and that's the situation that we'll have to monitor with Donald Young. He, he really is a great mover uh, uh, from the back of the court, but the shot selection and being comfortable up at the kitchen uh, is just a different animal. Yes, and Fed is just going to be begging him to get into the, let's let's start a Tom and Jerry cartoon right now. <laughs> yeah, that's no chance, and that is four. talking about what do you mean <laughs> oh oh just fed made it harder on himself yeah, <laughs> hitting it right back to Donald yeah D Donald didn't even try to break to the open court he just hung out he was shocked that fed hit it back to him and and fed lost a game to Rafa Hewitt earlier in, yeah. in the tournament as well so another thing to note yeah, and Donald looks just a little lost with his court positioning and his returns being a little short. Yeah, so, some of those first volleys, uh, the couple times he's been in that situation have been well off the kitchen line. And he's got a little smile on his face. He knows he's got to kick it into gear. And that's just the awesomeness of Fed. Inside out, you think you hit a good volley, and you're toast. Smooth, just unbelievably smooth. I just... I, I watch him so much. I just I want I almost want to see a weakness, and I, I just can't I can't find one. Oh my! And just so silky. Yeah. Eight nothing. Fed. Fifty percent inside out to the corner of the kitchen. Ah, oh, my goodness. Eight zero. Side out. A good first volley from Donald Young. So let's see if the pace and the athleticism that he certainly has displayed all day can show up here on Humana Championship Court. And the answer is yes. Yes, it can. As he steps over to his left and crushes a cross court lefty forehand, he's going to need plenty more, but that's a great place to start. One eight. Oh my. Oh, and then misses the next one. Yeah, sliding into several shots and a good decision by Donald Young in the heart of that point to let the ball bounce and uh, put some more pressure on Fed that way. Uh, as, as we mentioned, his court positioning coming forward has been a little slow to get all the way to the line. Two eight. That is just such a good volley again, that little cut into the short court. Yeah, and it's, I want to talk about Donald Young because he's an elite mover. So that shows how good that shot is from Federico that he can't even get a paddle on it. He said he's ripping right twoies earlier, and that's exactly what we saw on that last point. Is that ball about six inches from the baseline with plenty of pace? Oh, 
play. TP just deep for Donald Young and uh, went for the uh, body shot. Yeah, there was no question. He did not miss his spot. He was targeting the body. Questionable decision <laughs> against Fed, but a pretty cool single, singles firefight. Point. Point. Great serve, an inch from the baseline, and Fed is on a mission. He is at game point. Donald. The official ball of the PPA Tour. This is the favorite shot inside out there. He must have heard me talking about repeating his mechanics yeah. as he, he does. <laughs> as he, he does a little shadow swing as he, as he missed his contact point right after my uh, my statement. Trying to prove you wrong. I can miss. <laughs> I can miss bad. Just in case he'll take he wants, he wants the stats. He wants the clean winner stat there. Yeah, I've had those stats. Really nice volley short in the court and another crack at game one. 10 2. Side out. And Fed got there in plenty of time. Just pushed it wide, so a little net court help. That is just. That's just pretty. Yeah, it is. Uh, he's had a couple of those in game one, and I know it's it's a lopsided affair, but that ball is stung cross court. You can see on that phenomenal replay. Yeah, OD, no, no, no. And it's we've watched all the tennis players. They get too far from the ball then because they're like, ooh, this is a tennis shot. I've done this all my life. Uh, Fed's gonna go. Yeah, I think it caught. I think so. And 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 Donald Young, it's gonna be tough to get game one, but the the shots early in the point have been better throughout the game. He he was really struggling with those first couple shots. Uh, early ball. After video Howard. review, the in rolling stands. The ball's in. Loss of challenge results in a loss of timeout. You have one remaining. You have no timeouts remaining. We resume play at side out 310. Very. Authoritative there, Howard. <laughs> now, in the old day, he would have lost his serve yes. here, which yeah. I love that we got rid of this. Losing points on just standing wrong was not fun, so redo. Yeah, there's, there's right enough out. to think about. Yes. Especially when you're playing Federico Stacks Rude. Uh, just wipe that clean and let's focus in between the lines. Another chance to close it out. Wow, <laughs> that's not easy to do with the swirling wind to just hit that perfectly. And Donald certainly did. And his returns are wildly better here. So he saved four game points. I mean, these short angle backhand drop volleys are absolute perfection. Yeah, you, you can see him. He, he's almost trying to outrun the ball. Though everything about that shot is moving away from Donald Young. Spin, pace, all of it. So uh, just can't catch up. Oh, and Fed guides it instead of hitting through it. And these backhand returns down the line, it's the same pattern. Fed hasn't changed where he served, and he is going to have to keep trying to get that 11th point. It's been elusive. Donald stepping to his right to, to look for the forehand, which I'm completely fine with, but you have to understand sometimes you're going to give up some court positioning. Changes the serve, changes the result. So these players see 
the court so well. Little little adjustment. The creep on the court it is a big factor in the match. You just you just want to see clean. Yes. I mean, you just want to see clean, and when it's a backdrop or 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 or, or some One shadows down. creeping in, it can get into your head. I heard Donald say, "Yeah, that's too good." I mean, if you return in the middle, I thought all the all those angles are supposed to be gone. Not so much. Not so much. And that's another thing about repeating your mechanics. You make less errors, but you are also harder to read when it looks the exact same every time. So just so many benefits from doing that, and it's it's clearly very difficult uh, to do that, but Fed just makes it look easy. Four zero. And even, even going 50% with the roll, Federico stack. When the world sleeps, greatness rises. And while others dream of the next level, we chase it. Challenging every limit. Turning obstacles into stepping stones. Because the next level isn't just handed to you. It's earned. Go next level with 6-0 Pickleball. Yeah, stalactites and stalagmites I've got too. I don't know why. Hanging from the cave. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes, that's right. Oh, man. I just remembered stalactites with the C met ceiling, and, I, and it's in there forever. Forever. All right, Donald Young trying to make a run. And that is what earlier today I watched a little bit of his play, and it has been that. Yeah, blistered cross court. Not a lot of spin, flat with an insane amount of pace. Didn't stay down on that one at all, though. So gets a couple, though, and you got to go because Fed is one of the great closers we have. Yeah, even, even that didn't work out, clipping the tape and going wide. But Donald Young slightly fooled. Uh, he, he just took a half step the wrong direction, thinking that was going to go cross court. And uh, that's that deception on the forehand side of Fed Federico Stacks at work. What a good volley, because that was a reasonable approach. I mean, pass. And yeah, it's wa waist high on the first volley, not shoulder high. So to put it in that position deep in the court, good stuff. Another short return and down. <laughs> just that's what Fed makes you do. You just snaps his head back like there's no way. Yeah, no that's the way. Re really, man, really. Yes, sir. Side out. Again, quality return. It was really built throughout game one. Two, six, six. Like that adjustment from him, finding some depth. Not too good from Fed. Side out. Yeah, and that's the tennis. Again, we talk about the nuance. That's all you can do in tennis is just try to rip it. You have the kitchen. So if he drops that, he can maybe continue to play on in that rally. And we talked about how fleet of foot he is. So even more of a reason to occasionally roll that ball and force Fed to hit up instead of just slapping the ball with a prayer. Boy, slapping the ball <laughs> and living on a prayer. Where are my Bon Jovi fans? That was something else right there. I mean, when he when he hits it well on both wings, it's very impressive. And it's just been the ability to do that and clump a lot of those together. We've seen flashes of brilliance uh, from from ground strokes from Donald Young in this match. That is unlucky right there. He was clearly beaten was Stax Rude. Six, three, three. Oh, and a little paddle flip up the air and a little bit of frustration there from Donald as he was ahead in that rally. But we saw Fed do exactly what we just talked about, out of position, threw a ball on the ground and lived to continue. Yeah, and got a, got a pretty dang good look on that last three. shot because he threw it on the ground. Right out. Three, seven. Three, seven. Three. 
Side out. Side out. Didn't quite get underneath that ball enough. Boy, that lefty hook with the wind, man, that, that, that was a lefty specialist in baseball kind of Seven, look three, there three. to get a left-handed batter out. That was an impressive spin. Just attacking forward, Federico, uh, so good. And I'm not just talking about kitchen play. It's when there is a sitter or short return or anything in the middle of the court, he just charges after eight, that eight, ball, eight. taking the time away from his opponent. Point. Nine, three. Nine, three. Routinely into the open court, and we are at match point. We are making seven finals in a row point for Fed. Yeah, if you force your opponent to, to go with the lob out of the air in singles, uh, you have baffled them, and, and that's what Stackshrew does to his opponents most of the time. Timeout receiver. So, singles format, so uh, no biggie for me. Here we go, match point. Side out. Side out. And uh, Donald Young showed us in game one, he's gonna fight to the finish, saved a bunch of game points. Now he saved Great one time. match point. Oh, that is just outrageously good from Donald Young and that left hand helped on that one. It did. I love that patience from him. I, I, I thought he might just go with the Four traditional count. ground stroke. He let it travel and found the ATP. Side out. Pushes that wide. Match point number two for Match Fed. 10-4. And that will do it. Another big serve. And Federico stacks rude. From the world's most iconic tennis arenas to the glint of an Olympic gold medal, a new court beckons, a new challenge arises. Jack Sock has conquered tennis. Now, pickleball's next. Mastery, precision, passion, that's what champions are made of. And when it comes to pickleball, there's only one company they turn to. Jack Sock's legacy continues with the number one brand in pickleball. Selkirk Sport. We are pickleball. Well, nothing was going to stop you from locking up yet another finals uh, appearance on Sunday. What was working well? Uh, yeah, today I woke up, uh, legs were a little bit sore. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to try to go for my save a little bit more than, than usual. And today it worked out. Uh, I had a tough match on, on the second round against Rafa Hewitt. Uh, unfortunately, that was not in the stream, but that was uh, we had some crazy points. And uh, shout out to him, too. Well, Donald Young, still new to pickleball, comes from pro tennis. What do you see in his game as he makes his breakthrough run here today? A big win for him to just to get to this point. Yeah, I mean, if he puts on the time, like, uh, like all of us, he's going to be a top guy for sure. I mean, amazing talent. Uh, just his passing shots are, like, impossible to read. Uh, yeah, I just think he's going to be really, really good. Well, a bit of a brutal schedule for all of you pros out there. We have four tournaments this month of April. We don't have a single weekend off. What's it like to have to grind like that on tour? Yeah, it's a grind, but at the end of the day, it's uh, so much fun, you know, like, um, I think we all get along, you know, like, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's a privilege to be in, a, in, this, uh, in this position, so I'm really grateful for it, and uh, I just want to enjoy it as, as long as I can. Thanks, Fed. Good luck on Sunday.